Sweet to YouTubers, it's Rest Talk straight from Shalimar, Florida, and today we're going to do a video review of WWE Superstars Asuka. And this is from Mattel. Let me take a quick look at the box. I really look like the box, and yeah, this is like a Barbie doll. So I imagine it's about a 11 and a half inch that type dimensions. Here's the back of the box. I really like this look. I understand one of the first things you're going to notice is that she doesn't look Japanese. Uh, that's Asuka, signature style, bright tiger stripes, if you can look at that. You also have Natalia, Carmilla, and Lana, but that's okay. We're not going to talk about them. Uh, this is from Mattel, I believe 2017 or something to that effect. Don't quote me on that. Yet 2017, made in Indonesia. Okay, simple box, real, but I like it. It's colorful, but I'm like here to grade the box. Let me put that to the side for now. Uh, let's make the size comparison really quick. Uh, there it is. Masterpiece, there she is with Masterpiece Rodimus, or Hot Rod, or Rod, I forgot, whatever they call them nowadays. I like that. Maybe I'll review Rodimus. Look, notice that she towers over him. Rodimus is about a 7-inch figure, and she's about 11 and a half inches, Barbie doll size. I wish I had another Barbie ball, doll to kind of show you, but hey, she's a tall figure. All right. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to mark her up, so don't fret about that. I like her, look. Yeah, she's more Eurocentric than you think. There she is. There's her face. But I like the pink hair. I like the blue hair. It, it, if anything else, hey, it kind of matches the box. Why not? It is plugs. You're going to see that. Uh, so they are plugs. They're not like a weave of hair. Now she has a, well, she has an ear. So there you go. Um, look at her face. I like her details. Eyebrows. Brown eyes. Lipstick. Okay, <laughs> maybe I'm gushing. Looks like her head is on a ball joint. Let's see. Yes, I believe the elbow or the shoulders are in a ball joint, but they only move very limited. Swivel on the elbow and a hinge. I think there's a hinge on the arms. Not much of a swivel, but I think it pops out, but I'm going to try. I think she has an ab crunch. Neck. Nope. No waist articulation. She can kind of do this. Uh, she can do the splits here. I know that it's a ball jointed thigh, uh, but yeah, she could definitely do the splits. There's no doubt about that. <laughs> Let's see, knee, yeah, just one joint there. Uh, the feet can come off, but that's it. There's no ankle articulation. Yeah, even her tiny little feet, kind of difficult to stand. So, it is what it is. But it's a Barbie and, and it's okay. Alright, that's her face. I want to try to mark her up. I'm going to go ahead and give her a 7 out of 10. Look, I've been giving her that kind of... It's not bad. She's not bad, okay, for what she is. I mean, it's relatively cheap. You can get on Amazon now for like 12, 13 bucks. Uh, enjoy yourself, pose it. It's definitely something you can pose. There's nothing... Nothing horrible. She stands up just fine. Okay, just give me a second. I'm going to mark her up and see what she looks like. <laughs> well, tell me what you think. I don't know. To me, it looks like it's an improvement. I don't know how much more of an improvement, but it is. <laughs> what can I say? Hey, don't take my word for it. There she is. What do you think? <laughs> All right, enough of that. Hey, I'll catch you all next time.